everybody. How you doing? Welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. <sighs> I'm going to do a follow-up and I'm going to keep working on this. Um, I got attacked again last night, psychically. I when I, de when I deleted all my subscriptions, one of my subscribe people I subscribed to, I sent her a message. Just a party message. It wasn't nothing bad. I was just letting her know to be careful, you know, careful who you promote on your channel. I think because not everybody works for the light and you know hope all your dreams come true really simple and I got attacked by some chick who was who's doing dark magic you know cursing me basically I should have just sent her a private message I know I should I should know better because there's you know they're they're trolls and they're out there and they're evil and they're this young lady is just you know you know I would pray for her you know Hopefully she has nothing but love in her heart. That's what I want for everybody. You know, and it hurts my heart when people attack me too, because I'm like, damn it. You know, I'm not here to get people to hate me. I'm get, I'm not, you know, I'm, I'm getting people here to love themselves. And it's not easy because people are, you know, going through it. And there's all the distractions of the world. TikTok, Instagram, all these things that keep people, you know, it's like, you know, glitter. All the glitters, right? All the sparkly so you can't focus on the truth of what things are. And she's young and I don't, you know, I don't take it too personally. It's just, it still sucks. Like I said, when you get psychically attacked by people, it's just, it just, it sucks. It's just not, it's not a good experience. And you will experience it as a light worker. They're going to come after you. People, like I said, especially like this young lady. And she, she seemed to see, yeah, she was, thought she was so wise. She was, she was trying to lay down the law for me. But the point was, is people don't understand their intentions. She might have been doing it on purpose. I'm, you know, who knows? But the, the idea is your thoughts are power. And when you think negatively about anybody, that's not my job. I'm not here to think negatively about that girl that attacked me. I'm not here to think negatively, negatively about the, you know, the dark side. You wish your enemies well. That's the, the power of the love. That's the power of the light. You don't fight dark with dark. And trust me, I'm a brawler. I'm. I grew up in the street, you know, I've been in the fights. I know my my instincts as a man, my first instinct, like with that guy down at the, the Uber driver, my first instincts with people like that, and there's different, like I said, there's different level of toxicity in people. There's different level of low vibration. There's some people that are just low vibration and they're, you know, they're, their energy's stinking up the place. And then there's people that are basically demonic. They're basically possessed. They don't even realize it because I tell you what, the darkness, just like God works for you through you, the darkness works through them. And they, they're just puppets. I mean, people will be doing stuff and they're not even in control. This dude wasn't in control. He was being run by the darkness. And my first instinct, and that's another thing, they, you recognize your counter. I recognize, I've learned over the last two years to recognize the darkness in people. And especially when they're demonic. When they're demonic, I know instantly. And that's really, it sucks because I can feel it. It's like instant, it's an instant recognition when you see them. And here's the thing. They instantly recognize you too. So it's not just like me going, okay, there's the bad guy. The bad guy sees you too. And most people don't run that deep into the, the you know, into the battles, into the spiritual war. But most people are just like karmics and they're running around and they're not, they're not, like they're not working their light properly you know i mean we you got to understand the 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 faith systems that we've been the people have been locked in that force you to mindset to be one way i'm to I, I basically am disassembling every religion in the world and picking the stuff that makes sense and works and then you put it all together and that way everybody in the world can have a page that they can look at and everybody can agree on that this is how people should act and believe and think First of all, love, not hate. I don't hate this girl. I never will. And I hope she never doesn't hate me, and that's sad if they do. But because you, you can't control other people's emotions, you can't control other people's thoughts. You can only control your own. And it's important. I control my thoughts. My thoughts are pure. I want happiness and love for everybody, and that is how you shine in the light. People go around thinking negatively about other humans like me, and that's attack. It's like I tell people, you have power. Everybody has psychic ability. 
Most people are retarded when it comes to psychic ability. I hate to say it, but they just don't understand it. They're just not caring about it. You're low vibration. You're not out there being, throwing chairs around with your mind like a Jedi because you're just, you're not. You're just, uh, you're not. So you got to be careful with that. So careful with your thoughts. Think happy thoughts. That's how it starts. And that's how you love yourself. You just cleanse yourself of all negativity. Wish well to all your enemies, people that have hurt you, even people that have hurt you. I hate to say it, but that's how you heal yourself. You, you thank yourself, you forgive yourself by forgiving them, that kind of thing. So we're going to work on this. There's more to do. I need to talk about, you know, this is just part of it, you know. And there's, like I said, I have 800 videos. I'm going to piece them all together because, like I said, I've been learning as I grow and, and go and finding ways. And, and like I said, you, you're, if you're in the battle long enough, it's instinctually you become instinctually you're you're just on it there's people it's like um best way to describe it is military training when when you before they send guys off to war they train them extensively so these people when they do get caught in combat or something they automatically react they don't freeze up they that's why you hear these people talk about oh my training kicked in that's what this is i've spent the last two years in boot camp spiritual warfare getting my ass kicked by the darkness and and surviving but still getting attacked and, and having to absorb it and then having to cleanse and then having to you know and then having to not re, you know just keep going and just stay positive and keep the world light and, and love and yeah so it's been interesting so I want you to remember you're in it this is a war and people are you know you got to pick a side and don't be caught up on labels and boxes that they put you in because that's where they get you. The division. We are all one. We are all symbiotic. We are all in, it's on the microscopic level. Every human is connected. Good and bad. And that's, that's, that is the big crime when it comes to harming another human being. Regardless. When war, when it's a crime, when you hurt another human being, you're hurting you know, the fabric of the universe. And it's tearing it apart. And it's really bizarre, but that's the truth. Everything, everyone is precious and everyone is a miracle. Like I said, some people just don't respect and, and appreciate the miracle. <sighs> that being said, I love you. And God loves you and the universe is crazy about you. And they want you to rise up and be good and love yourself. Be powerful as an emperor or an empress. Yeah. Be careful with your thoughts. And think positive. Have a wonderful Christmas. And I love you. I already said that one. I'm gonna let you go. I just wanted to talk about this because it's important. Psychic attacks are gonna happen. It's just the way it is. People are gonna be envious of you. They're gonna see your light. And they're gonna want to snuff it out. Like I said, and a lot of these are dem demonic. There's not everybody is that bad. Demons can come in any form too. They're not just some cracked out person living in their vehicle who's just really scary. It's it can be a business person. It could be a politician. It could be a cute young Russian lady that wants to curse me. You know, it doesn't matter. It's just they come in all shapes and sizes, so you gotta you gotta check yourself before you start hating or fighting anybody else. Look inside and see, okay, what can I do to heal myself and make myself a better human being, and then you can go out into the world with love and light. I'm gonna let you go. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye. Okay,